Now, I have to discuss. I have to discuss some of my favorites already. Already, and it's like gone. I had the remnants of a peanut butter jelly cupcake from Sugar Babies. It was delicious. It just like melted right away. And honestly, I can't say anything else that really stood out to me. Amazing. This is a fried chicken on top of like maple syrup, frosty, cool stuff. It's basically like a hungover breakfast at I have. Hi guys, I'm back in my car after a very intense cupcake challenge. I had a lot, a lot of cupcakes. You see this list? These are all the cupcakes I had. And I have to say, my favorite came from um, the cake shop, made a cherry bomb. It was awesome. The flavor was a little artificial, but it had peanuts and chocolate, and it was really exciting in the consistency and flavor. So congrats to um, the cake shop for your cherry bomb. Uh, and my best traditional cupcake came from my delight. They had an amazing red velvet cake with a great cream cheese frosting. Everything was super moist. I have to say, overall, I really wasn't that impressed. I'm so sorry, guys, out there, but, you know, I think a lot of these bakeries are not used to making minis, and consequently, there was a lot of dry cupcakes out there. But it was a fun afternoon. I had a blast. I can't wait to do it again. I look forward to trying cupcakes from other new bakeries. Um, a lot of my favorites weren't represented. Frosted Cupcakery wasn't there. Yummy wasn't there. But, uh, oh, I will tell you officially, though, the magic trick to making an amazing cupcake is adding bacon. Who knew? But cupcakes with bacon are just, oh, love them. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye.